In this video, I'm going to show how to get into your settings menus and also show your favorites setup. First, you'll swipe down, then you go into the major menus here. Down on the bottom right, you will see this settings icon. Tap that, and then it gives you the three options of system, appearance, and audio. We'll start out with the system settings. From the top, you can add your pilot name. Then there's the date and time. This does not update automatically for daylight savings time. The language selection. Units, you have imperial or metric. The software, this is where you'll go to update your core radio. We will demonstrate that in a future video. And then the calibration. This is for if you change out a switch to a two position or three position or a momentary. You can go in here after you've mechanically changed the switch and calibrate it so that it properly operates. I will show you a little trick about the time settings. There is no actual AM or PM setting. You'll see AM or 24 hour there. So to get to PM, you will have to go 24 hour clock and say it's two o'clock in the afternoon. I'll set it. There's 1410, you'll see that. And then if you wanna see that in PM, just tap that and then it switches to PM. You go back to AM, all you would have to do is again, go into the 24 hour clock. It's still 10 AM here. Then from this, tap that and it goes back to the AM setting. All right, now I'm gonna move on to the appearance. This is where you go to set the colors and uh, background colors for your core radio. For the background, you've either got white or black. For this video, I'm gonna stick with the black because it's just a good higher contrast. Accent color is for your buttons color. So you can change that to any of these settings. There's six options. We're just leaving it all black for now. Brightness is your overall screen brightness. It doesn't change much in this video from the look of the camera, but it does get quite a bit brighter and dimmer. Below that, you've got the auto dim feature. You can set it to two, five, or 10 minutes. The auto lock feature, which we discussed earlier with this unlock icon, set it to two, five, or 10 minutes. This will lock the screen so you can't inadvertently make any changes. There is an intro video that plays on the startup of the radio. Whether you want that on or off is personal preference. It does not affect the startup time of the radio. Next is the audio settings. The audio settings, this is where you'll set, change your button tones, your alarm tones, um, telemetry callouts, and eventually when the voice system is active, you'll be able to change the voice sounds or voice volume. With these, you can change these individually as you wish. If you noticed in this main menu, there's also a volume slider here. This adjusts these as a whole. So these don't change. But now in relation to this, you can raise or lower the volume as a whole. Next, I'm going into this, the favorites menu. I've got a few set up, but I'm just gonna go ahead and delete these. You see the minus icon pop up, just tap and hold. And this is what will happen when you first get your core radio. If you tap the favorites button, there aren't any there. The way to add them, you go into the major menu, and you select the ones you'd want to use the most, such as functions. You'll see the plus icon pop up, settings, and the receiver menu. Now from the home screen, when you tap that favorites button, these are quickly called up so that you have quick, easy access.